Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to plot your research result, the antenna radiation pattern in a polar chart. Here, I have simulated a horn antenna using ANSYS electronics desktop and the results are plotted here. So if you can see here, this is the 2D radiation pattern uh, which represents E plane and H plane pattern of the horn antenna. Now let us export the data of this radiation patterns using the export option and we will save it on the desktop with a name radiation pattern now the file is saved in the csv format now if you open the exported uh, csv file okay it appears something like this okay the first column is theta and then we have the samples of e plane and h plane but we have to prepare this excel in uh, another version so copying this data and we have to put like this first we have to put e plane content then theta again h plane content and then theta okay so this data i'll copy let us say control c here open a new origin workbook and paste that content here okay you see all four columns are copied here now what you have to see so here the e plane content is going to be in x axis and y axis is theta similarly we have to make this h plane content to x axis so to do that click here right click and then set as x so now we can see this is x1 axis y1 axis x2 and y2 this is how the data is prepared once it is done click here to select the entire data and then go to polar plot here and select polar r of x theta of y so you can see that radiation pattern is created like this now we can format this okay so what we can do so we will change uh, see the black color is going to be the H plane pattern I will just make this as H plane and this as the red one is E plane and we can uh, change the font uh, change the color and uh, the thickness of the line so just double click here and select line and make it as say 2.5 I will make okay now the uh, thickness is increased if you want to change the color you can change color here so for that first you select group and then make it independent then go to this line and you can select the style as maybe the dotted one dash okay and then the color you can change it to some blue color apply now we can see uh, the H plane pattern is a dotted line and E plane pattern is a red solid line so you can give here the font size you can change you can make it as bold okay so select this and make it as bold similarly here you can make it as bold now we can add the y-axis title by clicking on format select axis titles and y-axis title so window will pop up like this okay you select here text and then make this rotation to 90 degrees you type here the text that you want here in this case I have plotted gain in DB so I have typed it so then I'll just click OK on it you can see the gain is appeared here and if you want you can bold it select it and bold it now the graph is ready okay so the next step is we have to export it into the required formats so for that click on file export graphs open dialog okay so just save it to the desktop by selecting the path okay I will give the name here as 2d radiation plot and make the image type as PNG so click OK 
So now the file is saved on the desktop. So now you can see here on the desktop, there is a 2D radiation plot image. So double click on and you can see that this is the radiation pattern that we have created using origin. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share to your friends.